Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about solving systems of equations by elimination. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. And we're going to solve this problem here. 7x plus 2y equals 24, 8x plus 2y equals 30. Okay. Well, right now with elimination, I try to eliminate one variable by adding the two equations. Closest thing I can see is 2y right here. But I can't just add the two together. I'm going to take the second equation and multiply it by a negative 1. So, rewrite this equation. The, numer uh, the top equation, 7x plus 2y equals 24. And the second equation, distribute the minus 1 to all parts. Negative 1 times 8x, negative 8 x. Negative 1 times 2y is a minus 2y. And negative 1 times 30 is a minus 30. All right. So now we're going to add the two equations and our goal will be revealed. 7x minus or plus a negative 8x is a minus 1x. 2y minus plus a negative 2y is just 0. The y's are eliminated. Got it. 24 minus 30 is a minus 6. Okay. Divide both sides by negative 1, and let's get x by itself here. Negative 6 divided by negative 1, positive 6. All right. So we got x equals 6, and we need to plug it into one of our other equations to solve for y. Let's go with the top one. 7 times 6, right here, 6 in for x, plus 2y equals 24. 7 times 6, 42, plus 2y equals 24. Subtract 42 to both sides. 2y is right here, and 24 minus 42 is a negative 18. We now divide both sides by 2 here to get y by itself, and y equals negative 18 divided by 2, which is a negative 9. So we have our x and y value. Let's put it as a coordinate point, 6 comma negative 9, and there we have our final answer, 6 comma negative 9. So now you learned how to solve equations by eliminations or systems of equations. If you did, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So, as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math. Minutemathtutor.com